To solve this, first we need to put 162,000 as the product of its prime factors, which isn't quite as hard as you think. 162 is 2 times 81, which is equal to 2 times 3 to the power of 4, and 1,000 is equal to 8 times 125, which equals 2 cubed times 5 cubed, so therefore 162,000 is equal to 2 times 3 to the 4 times 2 cubed times 5 cubed, which equals 2 to the 4 times 3 to the 4 times 5 cubed. Now to have a perfect square, we need our factors to be of the form 2 to the a, 3 to the b, 5 to the c, where a, b and c are all even, and a, because of 2 to the power of 4, so A can be in the set 0, 2, or 4. B can be in the set, because we have a 3 to the power of 4, 0, 2, or 4. And C can be in the set, because 5 cubed can be in the set 0 or 2. And therefore, the number of perfect squares is we've got three choices there, three choices there, and two choices there. Multiplying them together gives us 18 different possible perfect square factors, which is answer. Hey.